to another episode of Tang's Closet. So in this episode, it is gonna be a circuit breaker edition because I bought all the items during this circuit breaker period. So I understand that this circuit breaker is pretty stressful on individuals and therefore I found my own distress method which is to shop online. What? So in total, I bought uh, 16 items and they cost about $100 plus in total. So let's get going to see what did I buy during this circuit breaker period. The first item on the list is this basic tea which has plain flowers on it and the reason why did I buy this um, basic tea is because I really like the flowers on it and there is this sentence right here I like summer and you so I decided to buy it simple as that <laughs> And the next item is this jeans. I have recently been buying a lot of jeans online because I realized that jeans are really very handy. You can wear them for formal events or informal events. And I really like jeans that has more waist and then it flares at the bottom. And the next item, I have this very cute top that has an elastic at the bottom and it's pretty crop top and it's a bit translucent but it's cute so similar to the previous item I bought another cute crop top with an elastic at the bottom again and I like this this is not exactly a v, v neck but it's a rectangle v neck because it actually portrays and showcases your collarbone which I really like it a lot if your collarbone is one of the assets that you can show, show it! <laughs> and for the next item, this is actually slightly different from the picture that I saw online. Very different to be exact, but I think it's pretty cute, although it's different from what I initially wanted. And the next item, it's another pair of jeans. And I'm quite sad because I got the size for these jeans wrongly. It's so much bigger than I thought, and even when I put on a belt, right, it has so much excess at the side and it doesn't show the figure that I want it to show. But it is still pretty unique because it flares at the bottom right here. And again, I got another cute top, white top. I think that this is really super cute, especially with the red outlines with the white. And another item, well this is gonna probably shock y'all because I don't really wear purple but this really caught my eye. Although I'm afraid of butterflies and I really do. But this butterfly right here, it's so cute. It's pretty oversized and it makes me look skinny. What? That is partially one of the reasons why I bought it as well. And the next item that I got is this really cute black tube. And it's very cheap but the quality is really pretty good and what I like about this is that it comes with this which makes washing a lot easier especially when to hang it. So I actually bought another black tube and it hasn't arrived yet because of this circuit breaker period the shipping was delayed so I might have to show you guys that next in another video if I happen to do one next time. And then next, I bought this crop top flannel, long sleeve flannel that is pretty hipster, I would say. It looks really really good on a model in the photo and I wonder if it looks good on me too. So let me know if I look like a hype beast in the comment section below. I'm gonna graduate from university very soon and I will be going out to the workforce so I decided to invest in a proper formal outfit which is this so although it looks like a basic formal long sleeve wear but the special and unique part that captured my attention is the sleeve area around the wrist you can actually tighten it and it forms like a flower shape at the opening of the sleeves which is pretty cute and unique so that's all for the clothes and right now we are gonna move on to 
essential items. Would I even say it as essential? It's definitely more of a want than a need. <coughs> so the first item that I got is actually this, a beauty blender holder. So I actually have like beauty blenders at home, but I don't have a holder to actually hold it. And I have always been putting them on tissue papers or serviettes. So I decided to finally invest in one of these holders so that I can put my beauty blender on them. And the next item that I got is my concealer. So this time around, I actually got one that is a brightener and another one that is a concealer. So as you guys know, I have very very serious eye bags issues since young. So I have to get a brightener to brighten up the dark circles before concealing them. So if you have been looking at all of my vlogs, you should know that I have always been using this brand, the Sam, and it is honestly really very good. And the seller always gives me free samples that I can always try. Moving on to the next item, this item is definitely a want and not a need. I bought a portable fan right here. So. The moment I got this, my mom actually asked me, why do you need a portable fan? And my answer is, in case there's a short circuit, I can use it to blow myself. <laughs> and she told me, blow yourself only, not us. <laughs> so this fan, right, it's really cute. And I like the pink. And it has this stand where I can actually put a fan here. Like right here. And then there's a phone holder right here where I can actually rest my phone right here and it's pretty stable and the fan speed is actually pretty strong this is the first one second one and the third one <laughs> so I would say that it's actually a good investment in this fan finally the last item on the list is this so what is this so this is actually a laptop fan where I can open it like this and then put my laptop according to the height that I want it to be. So whenever I edit my videos, my neck often feel very tired because my table height and the chair isn't of the same height. So I often have to look down and it's very tiring for my neck. So I decided to invest in one of this. Hopefully it lasts very very long but it feels very sturdy. So, hopefully this help in my neck and health. What? And it actually comes with this pouch where I can actually put the stand inside and bring it out to wherever that I need it to be. So that's all for my circuit breaker edition. So, if any of y'all want the link to the items that I showed you guys, Feel free to leave a comment below or you can DM me on my Instagram and I will reply you with the link. So that's all for this Circuit Breaker episode. Bye!